Welcome back to Ballhead and Metal, guys. This today's reaction, I'm actually quite excited about because I asked you guys if there's a band like Elevate, and you guys recommended Arcana with a song Liki Besmernit Bogov. I don't even know how to say that. But if if uh, Elevate is more Swiss folk, this is supposed to be more Slavic folklore, uh, which should be interesting because I was born in Russia. I'm going to jump into it open-minded. I'm hoping for a mix of kind of heavier and folkier sounds, just like Fintroll, Corpiclani, Elviete, all these kinds of bands. Uh, but those who are new to this channel, just be prepared. Do I voice my opinion? But it's more in the spirit of conversation, how I personally feel about the music, my likes and dislikes, rather than the outright criticism of an artist. That being said, let's jump into the reaction. And if you enjoy the more analytical approach to the reactions, please make sure to subscribe down below for more. What I find interesting, she's singing in Russian. What I'm finding interesting, the style that she picks for her vocals, it's very reminiscent of, of uh, Slavic Russian folk or music and how people used to sing and how they stretch out their notes. So she's pulling from that, obviously, with her outfit as well. But it has this doom metal, almost like the, the black metal, doom metal kind of feel to the music. Uh, I can't say I am enjoying it just yet. But I am definitely curious. Well, I'm going to make this comparison once. This is nothing like Elviete, to be honest. I think Elviete did a nice combination of something that's catchier, something that's a little bit more... You can get into the mode, kind of headbang and have fun with. And this is a little bit more on the niche, kind of this emotional aspect to this. 
it's different. It's just very, very different. I don't think either of them is better than the other. Uh, I would say my liking is more towards Elevieti. This is, I think, more my brother's jam. But I'm intrigued by the choice of just showing her in a music video. There's not much else going on. I guess lower, lower budget music video. And the song itself, I, I'm waiting for it to shift into more interesting directions, kind of like a, like a river going into a different pass. Uh, but it hasn't happened yet. This was a nice change up in the song. I feel like it's just coming too late. Uh, it makes the song feel like it's 10 minutes long with not much going on. But this second part is really interesting. And the change up in vocals, I think, is really interesting, too. Uh, this harsher approach of guessing there's a very emotional aspect to her in the lyrics that even despite I'm listening to it, I really can't tell what the thematic or story is. <laughs> And that is the real Russian winter. At least that's what it looks like. I, I don't particularly like this, to be honest. I don't think it's bad. Uh, it's just... It has a good idea and it has a hook that's not fully developed yet. I, that's how I would put it. Like, some bands need a couple albums to develop themselves and really fine-tune who they are, uh, rather than right off the bat create something that's just absolutely unique, and then they kind of tend to like go down after a certain point. I don't think anybody ever stays on top. I think everybody kind of reaches a peak when they're just at the peak of their career, whatever they're doing, and it's like sports athletes, right? They, they rise, rise, rise. They have with the, the part where they've done the best, they've won all the awards, and then eventually the downfall. But this band, I think they're still rising, uh, at least from this particular song. I'm sure there's been a lot more. This is seven years old. Uh, if somebody can guide me to a better song than this, I would appreciate it because I don't want to leave it off on a sour note like that. Uh, because I, I do think these kinds of folklores are really interesting too. Like the Slavic folklore has a lot of interesting things and musically has a lot of interesting things to incorporate, just like Elevieta did with Swiss, Swiss folk music. Uh, that being said, I'm going to leave it on that note. I'm going to leave it to you guys to also express your opinions as well. And let's keep it metal, guys. Take care of yourselves.